I want to say hi to all my Facebook friends. I know you're all there. I'll, I'll say hi to you all personally in a minute. I don't, my tablet, I don't know where my tablet is, but I'll figure it out. Uh, you want to walk over with me? Where are we going? Oh, save $10. Get a brand new HSN credit card, and we will put $10 in your account. You use it for anything you want. Free 10 bucks, not a bad thing to do. I, I would consider that as well. Uh, but uh, grab it, and uh, lots of other great perks having an HSN credit card. All right. We are going to get into our second hour here. And uh, I have a quick promotion. My pick in the hour uh, comes to us from a company called GPX. Um, I have lots of their electronics in my house. I think they're fantastic. Uh, this is their portable indoor outdoor projector. Wow, it's the coolest thing ever. All right, if you want to watch that, now listen, I know you, you maybe you got a TV, you got like a, one of those TVs, like a 80 inch screen. What if I told you, you could watch your movies and your video games on a 130 inch screen? Yeah, for $139. Not only are we giving you the GPX machine, which is also a Bluetooth machine, you can, you can uh, listen to your music, built-in speaker, all right? It's also an, an FM radio. I mean, you can blast music outdoors, but you can also, with the projector, take your movies, whatever movies you love, and you can watch them on a big screen. And guess what? We give you the screen. In the old days, we would sell you this and you had to buy the screen separately. We're gonna give you a 130 inch screen to go with it. It is all in one theater, indoors or outdoors. I remember when you go to Disney, they show, and Universal, they show movies out by the pool. Kids love it. It's an LED high definition projector. I mentioned the Bluetooth speaker. It even has a mic, a microphone input, so you can use it as a speaker, uh, speaker phone or whatever you want to. Rechargeable battery, which is wonderful. So now you can take it outdoors and not have to worry about plugging it in. I mean, it's got everything. And guess what we did? We put it on free shipping. See a little slash through the shipping? We got rid of that so you can get it up for free shipping. So if you're looking for a great way to enjoy the outdoors uh, at, as we get into spring and summer, this is the way to do it at the lowest price that we've ever done. All right, come on over. We're gonna continue on. We're streaming live on Facebook. Apologies again to my Facebook friends. We got tornado uh, warnings uh, until one o'clock here today, or at least bad storms. So I gotta get home and get all, the, all my plants off my deck. So I have to race right home. So excuse me for that. Uh, let me say hi to everybody. My sweet girl, Mar Martina, Judy, Laura is with us today. Anita, I love all you guys. You're the best. Let's see, Rosemary is with me today. Uh, Rochelle is here. So lots, and Annie, if I miss anybody, it's because I'm scrolling. Uh, John is with us. Kimberly is with us. Janet's with us. What a great crew uh, we have today. Uh, and there is uh, Sarah. We got Sarah Bells with us as well. Um, Anita, I don't know if I mentioned your name. Everybody is with us today. Great, great crew. Um, let's get started uh, with this hour. So, when we first launched Alien Tape. All right, Alien Tape was four rolls of this really cool tape, and I love this stuff, I own it, all right? It's great, it's extremely sticky, and for a lot of people, it was hard to work with. They're like, it's great, but you know, cutting it and stuff, uh, you know, especially if you have issues with your hands, I wish they made Alien Tape that was already pre-cut. So all I'd have to do is take the Alien Tape out, whatever I want to stick, and I mean anything, all right? And it sticks to any surface. Wood, what, do you, what kind of glue sticks to wood, right? Wood's porous, brick, porous. Cement, porous, a great, it's fantastic on glass and, and painted surfaces, but it'll also stick to those other surfaces I just met, uh, that I just mentioned, it is amazing. So what we did is we took our famous alien tape, you can still buy this, I have it available, all right? It's a great deal, because you get four rolls, you get 40 feet of the stuff. You get more of this than you do with the strips, but uh, like I said, a little bit of work to cut this, or you get 210 of the pre-cut, pre-sized uh, pieces of alien tape. And all that you need to do, and you'll see how they come, they they come in these individual strips, right? And then all you do is you peel one back. They're so sticky, it's ridiculous. In fact, I'll, I'll peel this one off. <laughs> I mean, it's literally, I don't know if you could see, I can, it's barely can pull this off my finger. You can see how I'm pulling my finger right there, right? The stuff is, is ridiculous. I mean, you, you will never get it off. It's double-sided, so if you want to use it to um, mount, like if you want to put a vase on a table and you want the vase to slip over, put this under the vase. If you want to hang a hook in your bathroom, put it there so you don't have to drill a hole or put glue on there. If you want to use it outdoors on brick, 
Watch this. I have never seen any kind of tape that works on brick. This works there as well. 210 pieces, reusable. And by the way, we give you the larger uh, uh, alien tape pre-cuts, and we give you the smaller ones, because you know some jobs need a little more tape. So we give you all this. We give you sheets and sheets and sheets of the stuff. Here it is all out in front of you. Easy to use, you will love it. My very good friend, Chad Allen, is standing by. And Chad, don't get me wrong, I love my original <laughs> alien tape. I use it for like carpeting and runners where I need a long piece, but the pre-cuts are so, so convenient to use and so easy, and this stuff really works. Yeah, alien tape's not gonna go anywhere. We're gonna have this stuff for a real long time. There's a use for this, no question about it, but yeah, when you want pre-cut, this is what you're gonna pull out, quite frankly. 85, 90% of the time, I'm pulling out these pre-cut strips now. And Guy, you laid it out perfectly. There is no adhesive or residue. There's nothing sticky. It's just hundreds of thousands of suction cups. But my role here, let me just show you a lot of demos in a very uh, short period of time of how you might use it in your home. But don't forget, if you do need more restocking of your alien tape, we do still have that. It's not gonna go anywhere. Okay, ready? Here we go. Uh, this is a marble backsplash. Welcome to my kitchen. Good morning, everybody. Happy Saturday. I put two pieces of alien strip right here. You can sort of see it, but you'll get the idea in just a second. All I'm going to do is take off that protective backing, that yellow backing. The strip itself is not yellow. That's just a, a little plastic protective backing. And the reason we do that is because of the nano grip technology. It's hundreds of thousands of suction cups, making it very sticky. But again, there's no residue. I love to have uh, uh, my spurtles on my backsplash. So I'll take my spurtles and I'll just put them right there on those alien strips. Now there's no setup process again, because again, it is suction cups, not sticky residue. Now, if I ever need to use that spurtle, I can just take it down. I can use my spurtle, clean it, wash it. And then all I do is sort of press it against those suction cups again, and it's gonna hold it there easily and simply without ever having to drill, nail, screw into my marble backsplash, which if you ever do that, you can't be friends with me because that's a big no-no, right? Don't break your expensive marble. Um, and the next demo I'll do before I throw it back to Guy here for a second, is people love to have, people, myself included, love to have a spice rack where they can see their spices. So you know how much you have, you know when you have it, et cetera, et cetera. I put two, just two, again, you get 210. I just use two and I'm gonna take off that protective backing, again, only because it's hundreds of thousands of suction cups come into life every time. And so what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm gonna line this up. The hardest part is getting it level because I'm right really close to it. And I'm just gonna press, and what I can see that you probably can't on your camera is I can see the little air bubbles escaping because again, it's suction cups. I give it a little Chad tap test. I like to do that because this is the part of the presentation where it seems like it's too good to be true. And in this case, we're changing all that because it's not too good to be true. It really does set up in that short of time. So in the one second I've been here, I've hung my spurtles up where I can use them and put them right back. And I've also included a spice rack on my barbell backsplash. But guy, the offer's unbelievable. When we come back to me again, I'm gonna show you a sign. I'm gonna hang up our bionic lights coming up and even our disc lights here in a few seconds. Yeah, I, I, it's very, very convenient. And, and you, you, you just have this in your drawer you're gonna come up with a thousand different ways that you can use it, right? Whether it's to hold something in place. You know, I, I, I often talk about the, when I lost the, uh, a really, I had a really expensive vase. It was given to me when I got married years and years ago uh, from, uh, from family members and it was handmade, all this stuff. And I had the thing forever and I had it on a table, a wooden table. It stood about, I don't know, maybe 18 inches high. It was beautiful. And uh, I, one day I hit the table when I was putting my sneakers on to go for a run and it fell on the marble floor and it cracked. And I was like, Every time I think about that, I was like, if I had a little piece of alien tape underneath the vase, which you wouldn't see, and it's, it, it's, it's, it's thick, but it's not super thick, so you feel like it's elevated. If you put that on there, it would have never tipped over. It would have stayed on. It's, it, there are so many different uses. Um, you know, Evie, wanna, you, you, what about your, car, your phone in your car? You don't, you don't have a fancy way to put your phone up in a car. Take a little piece of the alien tape, put it on the dash, stick the phone on it. There you go, just like that, right? And remember, the way to release it, to Chad's earlier, uh, breakdown of it, it's not a glue. 
the, the reason it sticks is it is thousands of little what they call nano suction cups. You can't even see them, but they're little uh, little sort of concave little um, impressions on, one, on that one side, and they are like glue. When you put something on there, just like when you put one suction cup on something, but the problem with one suction cup is if that one suction cup has an air leak, the whole thing falls down. Anybody that's hung a, a shower brush in their shower in the middle of the night, here's a clank, and they think somebody's breaking in. It's because one <laughs> suction cup is not enough. Each one of these little squares that we have here, and I'll pull this out, each one has thousands and thousands of little suction cups on the other side of it. You can't see them. And when you push it down and rub it with your thumb, all those little thousands of cups stick to whatever surface it is. That's why it can work on brick. That's why it works on cement, because it has massive, massive amounts of touch points that will stick to whatever it is you need to put it onto. That's what makes it so easy. As far as using it, Peel it away, stick it to whatever you want, peel the back off, stick whatever you want on there. To release it, just like with a regular suction cup, don't try to pull it, all right, because those suction cups are not gonna give. Turn it. So if this guy wanted to remove that, he would simply have to turn it uh, 90 degrees and it would come off. But with all those cups, how many things do you know you can stick to stone? Right? It's impossible. $20 gets you 210 of these. Very busy. There's a great use of it right there. Look at that. And plus, they hold a lot of weight. So for me, Chad, there's not a home in America that can't use this, right? I mean, there's a lot of things we yeah. have that are just for certain people. These are for everybody. Yeah, we actually, my friends and I go on vacation every year in June. We take them on the, to the Airbnb because you never sure. know what you're going to run into there, what you're going to want to hang up. Uh, I know we're running short on time. Uh, we have like basically the whole hour together, Guy. Lots of great Bell & Howell products. Yeah. Uh, but the disc lights are very famous, especially in the springtime. And how do we hang them up? How do we mount them? Of course, you could always do the traditional way with the stake, but the alien strips are so easy. Here's that backing. You just take that off. I already uh, applied it there. I'm going to stick it to my marble backsplash. One, two, three. Okay, there. It's good. <laughs> I mean, that's what it takes. And if I ever want to take it down, this could have been my balcony if I didn't want to kick them off. It could have been my runner, my ottoman, if it's slipping and sliding. Now, this disc right here, I, th I actually, you probably don't even notice, I brace myself because I try to pull it off the wall and I can't. That's not how it works, right? It's a suction cup, so you need to break the seal. And so if you take it and you spin it, now I actually broke the seal of the suction cups. I didn't mar it, didn't scratch it, didn't leave any residue. And then I can come back here, take off that alien strip, and I can wash this and reuse it over and over and over again. I'll put it right back there onto that disc light. Now, I didn't wash it, of course, because I knew I just put it up there. It wasn't there for a year. I'm going to press that disc light's there again. When you buy disc lights, they usually come in a pack, so you're going to get multiple, so you might as well hang up a couple of those. Now, think about the holiday times, Christmas, Thanksgiving, Easter, Valentine's Day, you name it. There's going to be different things to hang up. This is from Gasparilla. If you're not from Tampa, you probably think I'm crazy. We invade with pirates all over the town. It's a big deal here in Tampa Bay. Uh, so I put this on my bathroom during Gasparilla Parade. Uh, and so I take off that protective backing, and then look what I can do. This could be anything. Christmas lights, you sure. name it. Think about any decor. And if I just push that there, one, two, three, four, five, I just make sure those suction cups adhere. It's there for as long as I want it to be there. If I don't want it to be there, again, all I'm going to do is take it and rotate. I'm going to break that suction with all those suction cups. Again, doesn't mar, doesn't scratch, doesn't scuff. And then all I do is take down that alien strip wash it and reuse it over and over and yeah. over again. Now, guy, we do have some of these coming up. This is the same way, these bionic lights, super bright 200 lumen lights, even with my lights on, you can see that. You're gonna wanna hang these things up. And although we give you 3M tape, it's not as great as the alien strips. Right. <laughs> so if I take off that protective <laughs> yeah. backing, I can put that right there, one, two, three, four, five. I'll turn this flashlight on. You know how these magnetically mount. And now I have that flashlight everywhere I need it. 210, yeah. 105 oh. of each size. Guy, Woo, so you, good. <laughs> you know, I, I would say you'd be hard pressed to use them all, but I, I, I know how much, how many times uh, it comes up in your life where you need to stick something to something else. And not only at home, at work, in your car, when you travel, uh, even if it's just for your phone, or maybe you want to, hey, maybe you want to put your tablet up, uh, you know, on the back seat of the car, and you want to stick it to the, you know, to the back seat so the kids can watch a movie. Use a couple of pieces of alien tape. Literally, the uses are endless. And remember, it works on stone, tile, glass, brick, painted surface. Uh, and much more, you know, there's a great idea, right? Hey, I, I want to watch the weather. I can't find the remote control. 
Look at that, the plug. <laughs> I love all these uses. My bird feeder. And remember, you can't drill through glass, right? And I don't know how many of you have tried or thought about putting a soap dish uh, in your or around your shower. Not a good idea to drill into a tile by yourself. That needs to be done by a professional. You can use the alien tape for that as well. I know it, we says we ran out of time. We're going a little bit longer. As you can see, we are crazy busy. People are buying four and five sets of this. Get it home. Chad, I, I just think, I, don't like I said, I love the original alien tape. That's what I have. Um, the alien strips are just an easier way to be able to have pre-measured stuff when you're in a hurry. You know, like w when I'm doing things like runners or if I'm doing a, like if I'm doing um, a, a heavy, a bigger picture frame, I'll use a longer strip of the alien tape. That's why I have that. By the way, we, mm -hmm. we have that too. If you want to, if you want to get that, it's about the same price, I think. Um, we have both. So we have a four pack of alien tape, 10 feet each, 40 feet. So if you want to measure your own, you can do that too. We just find that a lot of people like uh, Chad love to have it pre-done. Just makes it easier, right? I for sure do. <laughs> yeah. When we pre-cut this, I was like, thank you. I mean, that's so yeah. much easier for me, especially during presentations. Uh, but they're going to come to you in all the different sheets. So if you do want to hand a couple out to a neighbor, you can do that. Guy, we're talking about tornado season here, right? We just talked about it today. You got to get home to get those plants. A little piece of alien tape on the bottom of that, you could stick that down to your porch and it wouldn't tip over or topple. Um, I live in a condo, same thing with my balcony. Now, if you're just joining us at the beginning of the presentation, I talked about how I like to have my spurtles back here. Do you see how they're sort of floating? I can just take my spurtle down, use it, wash it. And then when I'm done with my utensil, look right there, I didn't have to install, drill, screw, nothing like that. The hardest part of the presentation guy is just convincing people that what I just did is yeah. real life. It is not fake, hey. it's not a gimmick, it's not a joke. It, it really you know what's wonderful <laughs> about, about what we do too, Chad, is that we know everybody has 30 days to try it out. Exactly. I will just warn you, be careful because it sticks to your thumb like a glue. Even though it's not a glue, but there's no residue, the stuff is very sticky, which is a good thing because that's what it's supposed to be. Seven six five zero nine five. 095 Chad, you're staying with us. Are we going to go right to our lights? I think we are. All right, let's walk over. I'm going to go right over. So Chad is hanging out. You just kind of showed you a demo of our uh, of our bionic lights. I love these things and I own these. They are they are amazing. First of all, uh, they are they're the greatest uh, sort of emergency lights you could ever have. You know, if your power goes out, you got a backup uh, of these three wonderful lights. We have your choice. They come in black or they come in white. Everybody gets three. On the top of the light, you'll see there's a switch. It says on, off, or auto. Auto is motion. On means they'll stay on permanently. So if I want to turn them on permanently, I just turn them on like that. It's light in here, so you're not going to really, uh, probably not going to sense motion. But that's how you do that. Um, they are uh, battery operated. Very very easy and because they're LED the batteries last virtually forever uh, they are a super smart simple way to get instant light wherever you need it could be under cabinets where you might want to hit the uh, auto so that it turns on when it detects motion see everything under your cabinets closets right an area of a closet what about in your bathroom like near the commode so if you got to go in the middle of the night you don't have to turn the whole you know house on or turn the lights on they are removable with a magnet so that if you need a light to, to look under the bed maybe you need a light to uh, you know to just get to the fuse box to find out why the power's out. Drop my phone under the bed. Wherever you need it, you got it. I love the fact, Chad, that not only do they have motion, but you also can keep them on because sometimes you need a little flashlight, right? So you really have all the best of all worlds with this. Everybody that orders, are we really doing this three for 23 bucks? All right, you're going to get three of these, $23.95. You can use them indoors and they're weatherproof. You can use them outdoors. You have 360 degree uh, coverage with that uh, magnet. And remember, the magnet allows you to take it with you, remove it, so you have a portable light whenever you need it. And as far as the battery, if you use it with the, uh, with the, um, uh, uh, the uh, motion, you're gonna get 100,000 hours on that. I mean, this thing lasts and lasts and lasts because it's LED technology. Chad, great idea. Another item I think everybody needs. Yeah, the Bell & Howe brand coming to life again, 114 years in business at HSN, almost 11 or 12 years now. Wow. I've been with them since the beginning. The actual light itself is very unique. This base here is magnetic on both sides. So I can put this base onto any magnetic surface. And then this ball flashlight, this tennis size ball flashlight, actually sticks to the magnetic base all by itself. So as you can see here, a few minutes ago when I mounted this with our alien strips, I mounted the base. 
So if I need a flashlight, I can walk around with this wherever I need to. And then if I want to put it right back up there, I can do that. And I can also angle it whether I want to like, uh, you know, maybe I want to put it on my spices or I want to just, um, I'm trying to get this perfect. So I'm going to put the nice little halo down here, but all you're going to do is mount it. Okay. And then on the very top, and I'm going to show you this, I'm going to get a little close. There's on, there's off and there's auto. Now the auto is going to be a motion activated. Now I'm going to open this cabinet here. Could be a closet, a pantry, you name it. If it's dark and the motion activated is on, that light's going to come on the minute I go to reach in here to grab a, a, um, a glass. If it gets a little dark, I may not know which wine glass I need. Or maybe after a glass of wine, I may not know where my glasses are. So this is not even mounted because it is freestanding. So now I can move that around wherever I need it. You see how you can sort of see it, how dark this cabinet is and how light this cabinet is. That's exactly what we're doing here. Now, each of these lights is 200 lumens. Ooh, what does that mean? It means 200 candles, basically. Each candle flame is basically like a lumen as we're comparing. Now, yeah, this is bright. 200. Yeah. Now, keep in mind, I didn't even turn any lights off between these two presentations, which I will in a few seconds. But I want you to notice, even with my lights on, look at how bright and illuminated I am. If I take that away, 200 lumens coming to life. Now, guys, indoors or outdoors, keep in mind, as we run that video footage, you could put this in all the trees. There's a key mount on the back, a keyhole, where you could actually screw this and nail this to any of your trees outside. I hate to say this, but if then if intruders come, like somebody's crossing your property line, then all of a sudden you'll be able to see because those lights will illuminate and you're yeah. getting three of them. So imagine them as you come up the staircase in a dark night, guy, there's a million ways to use them. I have a couple of friends up north that uh, ordered these uh, about, I think maybe four or five months ago. And it's funny, they both got it for the same thing because they got them for their um, their garbage and recycle area. <laughs> because if you live up in, in Connecticut, you got skunks, okay? And where do skunks and raccoons hang out at night? where they can smell food. And you do not want to walk into one of those things. It was funny that both guys were like, yeah, I'm gonna use it where my recycle is. That way it's, it's motion, I walk out there. If there's anything out there, uh, you know, the, the, the skunk will set it off or I'll set it off, the skunks will run away. But if you have a power failure, you know, everybody freaks out. Look at how everything is lit up inside there. If you gotta work on your car, your bike or whatever it is, you've got light there that you can take with you and move around. There you go, take, take it right. I'd actually put one right against the fence there. Well, I, I, a big idea I, I, that I told people is put it in your commode. You know, when you, you gotta use the bathroom in the middle of the night, you know, you wanna turn on all the lights in the house or, or, or turn on the big bathroom light and wake up your partner, then put one there. You can put one under a cabinet. I've got a pantry at my house that's dark. I have one there, okay? So that when I open it up, I can see everything inside. I don't wanna install a permanent light. I'm only in there once a day, right? Maybe twice. There's no sense of having a full electronic thing run in there, right? Maybe you wanna put these, uh, you know, decorative, right? Uh, you got people coming over, you just wanna add some light somewhere. You wanna put them outside, maybe on the steps to your, uh, coming up to your deck so that when it gets dark, people aren't tripping coming up or down if they've, you know, had a few beers or whatever. You wanna make sure they're okay and they can see, that's a great idea as well. Everybody that orders will get three. Company's been around for over 100 years. $23.95. And again, I think it's important that we tell you, yes, they're battery powered. They're not rechargeable, but the thing is, it's LED technology. LED sips power. It doesn't use an incandescent bulb, which burns uh, to, to, uh, to use as energy. Uh, it uses basically these diodes and they run cool, so they don't suck up energy anywhere near a regular uh, a plug would do or a regular, uh, excuse me, regular bulb would do. So these will last you years and years and years, obviously based on use, but years and years, especially as motion lights, because I mean, you're only using them once in a while, but you will love having these. They're convenient. I love, Chad, that I can tilt them and articulate them. That's a big deal as well. Yeah, so you're able to decorate with them, use this as home decor, but also the way they mount and maneuver, you can just take it down and use it as, look, the rain. You can use it outside in the rain as you come into the shed, as you come into the house, the garage. With that motion activated feature, it really opens up a whole lot of possibilities. But we offer motion activated lights that don't give us the option to have it on all the time. <coughs> so if you do want this on just all the time and not motion because you're having a party or you name it, whatever, 
you can do that, which is really great for this item by itself. But the way they mount allows you to do a lot of home decor. And then as you need to take it down and walk away, look at that. Just take it down with you. Now, I turn my lights down here in, in my, I was say my studio, in my house. I'm going to mount a couple of these real fast because it's that easy. Now, don't, we, we are going to, I'm not going to uh, pretend like we don't give it to you. We give you the 3M tape and a, a, a molly and screw here in case you do want to hard install them. I always prefer the alien strips because it's our own company. I know how great it is. Uh, again, these bases are magnetic. I don't want you to think I'm doing something crazy here. The, so I'm just going to mount the base because that's all I have to mount because I can walk around with this tennis side fall flashlight. And then if I want to put that there, that's how easily I can get the under cabinet look I've always wanted, right? When I'm talking about, and then I'll put one right here. How about that? And so you're getting three of them. So for 23, what is it? Whatever it is, $23. Now I've transformed my entire kitchen to give me that under counter light that I really always wanted without having to call an electrician, without having to call a handyman. And then if I turn this one on, <laughs> even with the three on behind me, we're talking 200 lumens, 200 lumens, 200 lumens, 200 lumens also shining on me. There's a lot of light in this room and you can still see how bright and elegant this light is. But as Guy pointed out with those LEDs on the inside, that entire yellow circle is a cob, a C-O-B LED, chips on board or circuit on board. It means it just sips the power. And then that little circle center right there is gonna be your motion activated and your light sensor. Both of those things are built right into that center. So if you're within 10 feet, like this cabinet here, when I open this up, if I open it up, you notice that light automatically comes on because it knows I'm coming into it because that motion activated sensor knows that. This is that white version. It sort of blends into my cabinet, but it could very easily be that black one without any problem. And you can see that a little better, uh, but it could be the lower cabinets, the upper cabinets, but guy, my mom uses this at the RV, yeah. takes into the campground and see after just a few seconds, it automatically turns off. It's, it's brilliant. It's, Saves it's, the battery. It, totally brilliant and easy. It, install it yourself in a couple of seconds. Now you got light anywhere you need it. If you want to get it, it's a customer pick on hsn.com. We have to move on because we got people chopping at the bit for the garden <laughs> dealer. Oh my Chad, <laughs> they're already, they're, people are going nuts for the garden dealer. That's coming up next. Remember, you want to get them. I got them in black and I got them in white. They're fantastic. All right, let's get to the garden dealer before everybody on Facebook starts yelling at me. So anyway, <clears throat> there we go. Thank you. Oh, look at all my Facebook people. You guys are so sweet. I got all kinds of... Alice, that's this person I haven't said hi to yet today. I want to meet Tony. I don't know if I said your name. Uh, I think I've hit everybody else, uh, but just making sure we're streaming live on Facebook. No Facebook Live today. Got to get home. We can hear the storm, right, guys? We hear it already coming in. Tornadoes. I got to get home and clear off my deck, although my plants will probably be in the ocean by the time I get home. <laughs> Hopefully not. Let's talk about the garden dealer. Y'all know I do my garden show right on Fridays. Uh, guys in the garden, you all know I, I take and love my garden at home. Uh, I mean, there's lots of great uh, ways you can get your garden to look beautiful, but one of the things nobody likes to do is have to get down on their hands and knees, especially as you get older, right? And, and trust me, you know, I, I, I've been fortunate in my life never to have any knee problems, knock on wood. Uh, I know my brother's dealing with some right now, but getting up and down on your knees is very, very painful, very taxing, and very hard as you get to be older. Uh, what's wonderful about the garden dealer is you bring it wherever you go. Uh, it only weighs, uh, weighs like what, maybe a pound or two? You take it wherever you want to go. It holds up to 220 pounds. You can use it as a kneeler or as a seat to be able to tend your garden, paint the baseboards, clean around your house, go underneath the cabinets, whatever you need to do. It is brilliant, all right? I own one. I gotta tell everybody, you know what I use it for, right? I wash the rims on my car because I have a gravel driveway and you have to get down basically on your hands and knees to wash the rims in your car and I am not getting down on my hands and knees on gravel, okay? So I bought this one the first time we ever aired it. It is absolutely brilliant. Um, this is how it folds, takes up no space, okay? You have steel construction on this guy. Essentially, it'll open up, open one up and the other, and it locks. 220 pounds, you have this cushy foam on top. So now, if I need a seat anywhere I go, I put it down and I weigh just about 215 pounds so I can get on here. Now I can wash the tire, I can paint, I can clean things up, I can read a story to the kids, although Danny's six feet now so I'd probably be looking up at him. But you know, if you wanna play with your children and you don't wanna get down on the floor, now you can get down on this little bench. And then if you're outside and you're washing your tires or whatever you're doing, it gives you the support as you go down, knees on the pad, and now I can tend my garden, I can dig, I can plant, I can walk 
wash things, I can do that as well. Absolutely brilliant. Remember, I uh, like I said, I weigh just about the limit. I weigh 220 pounds. I've had mine for two years. I absolutely love it. I'll actually leave this one up. We have one, or I'll turn it this way so I can see you. We have one in green, and we have one that's in the brand new purple. I also have it available in the extra large, which is a little bit wider and holds a little more weight. We'll put that item number up for you. Chad, you know how much I love the garden dealer. We both do, and I know you love it as well, because listen, you and I are, you and I are not in our, in our 80s or 90s, but let me tell you, <laughs> Over, the, over time, you do a lot of damage to your knees if you don't have something like this to support you. Yeah, absolutely. In fact, I mean, this has been one of the first items ever presented years ago at the network. And uh, I think it's one of my most successful products I've ever been able to present, which I'm so proud of. And it just makes sense because here's what we're used to. Our knees go onto the ground. This could be cleaning, gardening, you name it. If you have to get down to the ground, it's hard. It's rocky. It's grassy. It's mulchy. It hurts our knees. If you're going to take gardening seriously this season, it's going to take longer than three or four minutes when you're on the ground. I hate to tell you. So you want to make yourself nice and comfortable. So you want to continue to do gardening and things like that. And so when you're able to take your knees, again, there's a clearance here, right? So there's a clearance, so it's not directly on the ground. That's how it's built. Made out of powder coated steel and EVA foam, the same foam you put in running shoes. That's why you've heard of EVA foam before. And it's a solid piece of EVA foam. It's brilliant. And when you put your knees up onto that, you're a lot more comfortable. Now you can garden, you can do things, and it's easier for you, okay? That's just one aspect. When you take a look at the oversized handlebars that she's holding on to, do you notice how she gets down? Do you notice how she gets up? Getting down to the ground, you don't have to fall. You don't have to just like fall down to the ground. You can hang on to those handlebars as you get down. And then instead of using your knees or your hips or your back or all the places you shouldn't be straining, use the assistance of having this really sturdy construction here. Now this garden dealer you're seeing on your screen holds 250 pounds. Um, I know we have a graphic that says 220 on the side, but it's been updated on uh, hsn.com. It's 250 pounds now, which is just fantastic. This is the upgraded version. If you're over 250 guy, as we like to talk about, if you're 400 pounds, or up to 200, or 250 to 400 pounds, that's when you're gonna to wanna to pick up the extra large version. Uh, but look at this, when I hang onto these oversized handlebars, I'm gonna use my arm strength to take it up. Do you see what I did there? And the same thing on the way down. If I can get down to here and I can hold on to these, then I can slowly, gently, easily lower myself down to the ground. I don't have to get crazy and fall down. And now I'm comfortable and I can work for a few minutes without uh, tiring out. And then all I do is flip it over. And I flipped it over while I was on the ground. And now I can use this section to help myself get up, come around to my rose bushes, because my rose bushes are probably a little taller, right? And now I can prune those. I can wash the car tire, like Guy was talking about with Danny, how he steals, <laughs> Danny steals Guy. Yeah. And then I can organize under the kitchen sink, paint the baseboards, because Guy, the alternatives are just not fun. There's no handlebars on these knee pads, right? So they're not gonna help you. You're gonna strap them on and you're gonna sort of scoot along. But then after 20 minutes, have you ever tried to get off the ground? <laughs> it's a little tough. Yeah. Right? And then these little foam pads, they're cheap, they are inexpensive, but they yeah. rip and they're just, you know, whatever. And so to get this home today, and then don't forget about our pouches. Um, uh, this is the gray, I didn't realize we were sold out of the gray, sorry about that. But you get two pack of these, they're only like eight bucks. Oh, and those you, are it's great. Four pockets on, yeah, it's yeah. four pockets on each. So then you can have all your tools with you <sighs> as well. If you're gonna take gardening seriously, guy, this is the tool you need. Hey, and Chad, why don't you, I'll let you answer this. Well, I bought mine, what, three years ago? What did I pay for mine? The same price you're seeing right yep. there. And Chad and I, and you yep. all know, what is going on with inflation right now? Everything is going up, okay? Uh, I, I love this company, IdeaWorks, that they've managed to keep the price low. They build a quality product. I've had mine for three years, and we put the max on it, all right? Danny, my, my son weighs 185, I weigh like 215. So we're putting weight on this thing, and it's lasting us every day. And you're right, Danny, that little punk, he, he tries to steal it every time he comes to visit. <laughs> He's already got my pressure washer. And you know what he did? He brought the pressure washer home because he was gonna pressure wash my deck, and he was gonna do it today. And it's raining outside. <laughs> and he's leaving day after tomorrow. And he'll probably take the pressure washer him. with him. Oh, I love him too, but he's a pain <laughs> in the butt. Uh, but he's a good pain in the butt. Get it on, we're very busy. By the way, you want the purple? How many left, Andre? 250? 250, left in the purple if you want that. I have the green, that's the original that we started with. It's green like your garden, you'll love it. Remember, you use it as a bench 
or you use it as a kneeler, either one. And then um, also, if you look at the sides here, how to collapse it, see where my fingers are right there? There's a spring-loaded mechanism See how, see how it's spring-loaded? When you close the spring, that's how you fold it. So you close that spring, you close that spring, and there you go. Mine, mine never leaves the front. I have it standing in a corner at the front door. All <laughs> right, that's where it is. And it's funny, Chad, I do use it for a lot of other things. I use it um, for, uh, like I said, cleaning. Uh, if I have to go underneath the cabinet, rather than have to try to get down on my hands and knees to do that, I use it for that. Washing the rims on the car, I've told you that. I love it for that. It's fantastic. Obviously, it's a gardening you know, became a, it was our gardening staple when we first came out with it. But people are using it for everything. If you got to paint your baseboards, right? Um, as I said, I you know, I was just thinking before I didn't even I didn't even plan it, but I'm like, what about if you're a grandpa or grandma and you and you want to be down lower with your kids, right? You always feel because grandmas and grandpas they want to do that. They don't want to be standing up while their little kids are playing on the floor with their blocks or cars or what Legos or whatever. This enables you to get down without having to get all the way down. And if you do need to get down, you flip it over, get on your knees. It makes it easy with the assist to get up. 600 people already have picked it up in the last five minutes. We are getting very, very busy. 200 left in the purple. That's going quick. Uh, most people are ordering the green. That's the original. And please remember the, uh, the extra large. Hey, Chad, just give 30 seconds on the extra large. Why do I want that one? Yeah, the extra large is going to be just a lot. It's going to be bigger by six inches on the yeah. side. I actually have one Binder. here live. I can show it to you. So here's the, um, let me back this up. Here's the extra large, and then here's the original. Both are fantastic. The original is 250 pound weight capacity. The extra large, my friends, is 400 pounds. So it's much more substantial. It is double the price, but if you can spend the $43, this is gonna be the way to go, whether you're 400 pounds or not, just because of how great and massive and solid it is. But don't be confused, even though I, I really harp on that one a lot, this is the home run product because you could pick up two of these for the price of the extra large. So if you're under 400 or under 250 pounds, I would say get two of these instead, only because I read the reviews. Man, you guys are smart. You're keeping one in the trunk of your car yeah. and you've been to the soccer game, the football game, the baseball game for the kids. You don't want to sit on the bleachers with the rest of the parents because maybe they're annoying or maybe they're, you don't want to be close to people. So you have your own seat to take wherever you want it. You put one in the trunk of your car, you go to the tailgate, you stop by a friend's house for a glass of wine. Yeah. They're outside of maybe a campfire. Sure. You pull this out of the trunk of your car, you bring your own seat. Thanksgiving, Christmas, you need that extra chair. There's a million ways to use it that I've read on just the hsn.com reviews, but if you're just joining us, here it is, ready for the magic. I need to get down to plant, garden. I need to get down to the ground, yeah. let's just say that. Hold on to the handlebars, slowly, gently, easily lower yourself down, don't fall, and then you need to get back up. Oh, and by the way, my knees are on EVA foam, not some sort of cheap mystery foam. And then if I need to get back up, don't use your knees or your hips or your back. Use your arm strength to get up off the ground. And then guy, Love it. at the end of the season or the end of the day, what you're able to do is fold it up. That's why you can keep it in yeah. your trunk. It just weighs a couple of pounds, solid steel construction guy. You can hear it's it. It's awesome. I, we are so busy. Yeah. All right, last call up purple. I only have about 100 or so remaining in the purple if you want to get it. I'm okay on the green. I just thought of another way I'm going to use this. I don't, you know, I have a smoker uh, uh, the, on my deck, right? Because I do ribs and stuff like that. But I also have a little, what they call uh, the Smokey Joe. It's the Little Weber barbecue, but it's, it's this tall. Chad, it's literally, that, that, it's literally, that, it's like, it's only that big, it's a little smoker, or it's a little barbecue, uh, barbecue grill. I just thought, I'm like, every time I go out there, I literally get down on my knees to light the thing, and then when I'm cooking the food, I gotta go down like this to cook it, and I'm, I'm, I don't wanna put it up on a table, because I don't really have a table out there to put it on. I'll use this, I can actually sit out there, tend my grill, you will find use after use after use for this, okay? Even if it's, you gotta fix something in the bathroom, right? Maybe, you, do you ever, did you ever replace a tank in a bath, in a, in a, bathroom <laughs> it's a nightmare <laughs> i don't recommend it but if you ever try to do it you are in so many weird angles on your knees trying to get that those screws out from underneath the back it's brutal use one of these you only get two knees right some people get more but they're not the original right like my poor mother <laughs> and her husband both my mom and her husband both have a knee replacement um so 
remember, you gotta save them. I, I have been lucky, like I said, even though I played ball and all that stuff, never had any knee injuries. And having something like this, you know, could do nothing but help you, okay? The less pressure on your knees, the less knee, your knee rolling over gravel and rocks and, and mulch, the better it is going to be for you. Chad, um, I'm gonna call, uh, the purple is almost sold out. I'll have, how many? 30 left in purple. I'm gonna let uh, Chad take the last uh, 30 or 40 seconds to kind of give us a last once over. Get this home, you'll love it. Under 20 bucks. Yeah, you got it. So $20, I mean, I could spend more on lunch today than that price, and it's not made out of steel. You're right, we've maintained the price for three years running, which is what we're so proud of. That solid steel construction, that EVA foam, that's the quality we're looking for. The price doesn't reflect that quality. It should be more expensive, there's no question. You can hang it up because it easily folds up. When you get it home, it's fully assembled. It comes out of the box just like this. This is all you, this is all you have to do, ready? You open up the handlebars, you lock so them cool. into place. You set it exactly where you need it, guy. You use this for your knees, you use your arm strength to take it up, you flip it around, you use it as a seat, however you want to use it. But at the end of the day, comfort is the name of the game, safety right. is the name of the game. So for $20, whether it's for you, a parent or an aunt, this is the item you need to get them. I just know you'll love it. All right, remember, uh, 220 pound weight limit, so make sure you're, you're safe under there. Otherwise, you can get the larger one. We still have those available. Chad, thank you for being such a big part of my show today, buddy. You're Wait, the best. Are we done? What's going on? Yeah, we're no, kicking I'll you out. At, I'll be back at noon. All right, pal. Bye thank bye. you. Thanks, Chad. All right, great job. 715-657. Hey, real quick, I've got something special on hsn.com that I just wanted to mention. It's our HP. Uh, it, basically, it's the slam dunk of all computers. If you're looking for everything the best brands we got hp number one brand anywhere uh we've got a pentium processor number one processor anywhere we got windows 11 number one operating system 512 solid state drive which means it runs super fast over a 10 hour battery i have it available with office or without office look at the price on a 73 that's almost i mean this is look at this that's almost a desktop all right we don't do anything bigger than eight gigs of RAM. If you're a multitasker, you're gonna need that as well. The value, over $1,300, half price. If you need a new computer, I strongly suggest that you go the solid state with the Pentium, with HP, with Windows 11. You will love this thing, okay? It is beautiful. I had a jumbo foot and a half screen. Come on, gorgeous. All right, uh, so that is uh, available if you want. I am so excited because coming up is my pick. You always dream of having like a 60 inch TV, 70, 80 inch. What if I told you we've got a screen that's 110 inches? Yeah, coming your way next and it's affordable right after this. There is nothing quite like shopping with a friend. So pull up a chair and shop with us. We'll be dishing the scoop on what's hot. Catch you up on what you've missed. And share some of our favorite discoveries. Come shop with us every Saturday morning at 10 a.m. Our HSN price is a great value that we bring to you every day. We work hard and have the buying power to make sure it's a value that you'll love. So go ahead, treat yourself with the confidence to buy now at the HSN price. Get the best deals on the things you love with the HSN card. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get all kinds of perks, like 12-month VIP financing on select items, plus extra flex on beauty, jewelry, shoe, and fashion purchases all day every day. And at least eight VIP savings events a year. Includes fraud protection, and there's no annual fee. Apply now and instantly get $10 off when you're approved. Call 1-800-695-1418 or visit hsn.com slash hsncard. The best way of getting ready for spring is to get rid of winter. So I clean out anything that smells like winter, looks like winter, or feels like winter. All right, here we go. So you know I pick one item every show. This to me is such a big wow. That's what Colleen Lopez would call it. When she likes something, she calls it a wow. It is so super cool. I mentioned earlier, you know, a lot of people go out and we, and we have them. You know, we have the 50 inch, 60 inch, 80 inch, big screen TVs. They're amazing. I think our, our, our biggest TV is like, what, an 82 or an 85 inch? And it's like, what, $1,200, $1,300, right? It's really expensive. They're wonderful. We love those TVs. But what if I told you you could have a screen that was 
one and a time, a half times bigger than that. I'm talking about 110, a 10, 130 inch screen. That's over 10 feet of screen. You can use it indoors. You can use it outdoors. This is our projector system. It's from GPX. I love this company. I've got a lot of their electronics. It is a portable indoor outdoor projector. <laughs> All right. It, normally they don't have the screen that comes with it. We're going to give you the 10 foot screen, over 10 foot, 130 inch screen. Now, please remember when you watch that, those kids are watching this because we have to show the kids during the day. When you'll see how it looks at night, because I'm going to turn all the lights off in the studio, this thing is amazing. How we are doing it at 139. I have no idea, okay? It says 167. Even my, uh, my producer, Andre, is like, I may get that. You know how much the kids would love this? To be outside on a beautiful spring or summer evening and put the screen outside and for them to watch their favorite movies outside on a big screen, eating their hamburgers, hot dogs, neighbors come over, everybody's enjoying it. Not only that, Okay, it's also a Bluetooth speaker. So if you wanna wirelessly uh, sync your music on your phone to it, you got outdoor music. So you've got video, you've got music, you can do your video games on this big screen as well. Can you imagine your kids outside doing their video games on a 10 foot screen? How cool would that be? Everything is included, including the remote control, all the cables you needed to connect it to any device. If you've got a, 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 a you know, VCR, whatever it is, or not VCR, if you've got a, a projector or whatever, or you know, what, a little camera, you can hook it up to that as well. Uh, as long as it's got the little AV plugs. We give you the screen, this is it, we folded it up for you. All right, you get the projector, there's your Bluetooth speaker that goes along with it with the light show so I'm gonna switch over should I go over to my screen now or what should I do let's go actually we're gonna go to Julie first Julie trust her my special guest and Julie you and I have presented this before people go crazy for it every single time now Julie look at little Julie in front of that giant screen Julie amazing Good morning, Guy. Whoa. Oh, my goodness. You did such a great job introducing this. And I tell you what, this is the best time of year to be able to get this. Spring fever, it's spring break. So you're going to have this. It, it is year round. But I love to be able to use it outside. You've got spring, summer, and fall. And it's so much fun. So this screen will turn any space inside your house or outside your house into a full-blown family entertainment center. This is like bringing the drive through movie into your own home. It is awesome. Now, I know Guy's been talking a lot about this massive size. So when you think about your big screen TV, they measure it on the diagonal. So if you measure it diagonal to diagonal, it's 130 inches. That's double the size of a 65 inch TV. It's in high definition. And also you can be, if you like to stream your movies or Disney plus or your netflix or live football on the side of this all you have to do is take an amazon fire stick or a roku any streaming device anything and you literally plug it in it's plug and play and then it casts on this huge wide screen and look at the size of these players if you're into sports you're gonna flip we always watch the the big game in what is it january february yeah. we watch the big game outside in florida on the side of our house <laughs> so you can project this and look at the size of the football players yeah i mean they're huge and this is high definition so all you need is a wall or you can use that screen you can do this use it in the basement outside i think the time of year this is outside you can cast this on the side of the house a garage door an exterior wall if you're using it inside your family room wall, if you have wallpaper or a weird paint color or wood paneling, all you have to do is hang up the screen that is included with it. Now, um, when it comes, it's totally plug and play right out of the box. So again, it has two HDMI ports on the side. I may have guys show you with what the projector looks like and it turns any space into this entertainment center. So on the side, you have two HDMI ports. You can also, if you have a flash drive and you wanna show family movies, you plug a flash drive in. It also has a micro SD card. So if you have family photos, let's say, you can load them onto an SD card, pop it in, and you can be watching your Netflix 
And then with your remote control, you can also be toggling between your family photos. So cool. This is crazy. It's so much fun. You know what? So I was just cool. thinking about holidays, right? You know, one of my favorite movies, yeah. we got St. Patrick's Day coming up. My favorite uh, movies is The Quiet Man. Can you imagine watching that on a 10-foot screen? How amazing would that be? And I, by the way, I have Netflix, so I can watch all my favorite shows. You know, I love Parks and Rec and all these shows. I could watch those on a beautiful evening. I could go outside, put this up on the wall. Daddy could have his friends over in the backyard and put this back there because remember, it's rechargeable. So I don't have to worry about, you know, all the plugs and all that stuff. Look at the size of it. All right. You all know I'm a big guy, right? Look at the freaking size of that screen. There's no TV that's this big out there, all right, unless you go to one of the stadiums. The, this is absolutely huge. Think about it. And if you've got a partner that loves sports, okay? You want to watch the big game, baseball, football, hockey, golf, whatever it is, right? Watch the Masters, all those great things. You can do it. We have lowered most of the lights here, and you can see how crisp and clear everything is right here. Get this thing home. I don't know how many we have, but I know that Julie and I had this uh, around the uh, beginning of holiday. We sold it out. We never got it back again. So we just got them back. Our right, good. My producer, Andre, says we're fine. We, they just got the order in. Get these home. Imagine this for Mother's Day or Father's Day. Can you imagine giving this to your partner and and saying, I want you to watch the big game on something special this year. I want to invite some of the neighbors over, some of the family. I want, I want the kids at, at Halloween to be able to watch spooky movies outside and you know, open their candy together. You can do all this on a screen of this size. Again, I'll stand in front of it. You can see how big it is. And then you can see the clarity. And remember, we don't even have all the lights out. When you turn, we have lights on the back of the studio over there. Um, when you turn it out, you'll see incredible, incredible clarity of this. Uh, even though I, it looks fantastic. I'm watching it right here, and I wish I was in a chair with a cold beverage with, uh, you know, with Danny and all of our buddies <laughs> and just enjoying it. I'm going to walk back over and show everybody exactly what you get, and then we can go back to Julie and me in, in just a sec. The projector, everything is plug and play. Uh, the, and I, I'm glad Julie said that because I think a lot of people get this and they're like, oh my gosh, this must be an electronics nightmare. No, it is not. You're not plugging in 38 different cables, okay? And you can bring it anywhere you need to go because you don't have, it's a rechargeable projector, okay? Uh, great, you just you know, plug everything in, you're good to go. $28, free shipping and handling, and Julie, I'm always amazed, and I forgot since uh, since the last time we aired it, at the number of different ways and things you can watch on this. Yeah, there's so many different things that you can watch on it. So on the side of it, you have your ports. So if you have any streaming device, like a Roku or an Amazon Fire Stick, it's literally plug and play. You just plug it in, and you can be watching your Netflix, your Disney+, Plus, your live sports. It basically turns the projector into a smart TV at a fraction of the price. Now, also, Guy, one thing I want to say is I'm holding the speaker right here. So GPX is known for their projector. HSN is the only place that gives you the bonus wireless Bluetooth speaker. So the projector on its own has a speaker, but if you really want to bring that movie theater experience to the house, just like guys saying, you bring the neighbor kids over, the neighborhood is over, it's the summertime, you're grilling, it's outside, you're poolside, whatever, that's with the speaker. That's what really turns it into that movie theater experience. And also, I'm holding it. I don't know if you can see, but it flashes LED color lights. So you get that whole experience, and that is exclusive to HSN. The other thing that you can watch, Guy, is you can also cast from your phone. So if you have a cell phone, you can cast whatever you're watching. You can also play video games with this with an HDMI cable. You plug it right into the HDMI port, and your kids are playing video games. You can also, if you have a laptop and you want to stream, that's how we watch the big game. We streamed it right from my husband's laptop. It's so simple. And let me tell you, if you're into sports, I know all the basketball games are going on right now. College, that's big in our house. Um, I'm waiting for all the big games to happen. You can be watching your live sports. And let me tell you, these sports players are humongous. It's This is a high definition. You'll be watching it. In. Yeah. And if you're soccer, so you can see you're watching the whole soccer game. And on that big game day, remember when the Bucks played in the, the big game yeah. two years ago? We were casting it outside. We had it on the side of our house. We also had our high definition TV on. You know, I think it's a 65 or a 75 inch TV. Nobody came inside because the experience is being outside. Yeah. We had our fire going. Oh my gosh, 
so much fun. It really, it's wholesome family entertainment. If you go to the movie theaters with your kids, you're going to spend probably over $100. And then, goodness, if you buy the popcorn and a drink, you're well over $100. Yeah. So this is affordable. It's a great family. Yeah. I, I love what you said. Mother's Day, Father's Day. This is wholesome as wholesome family entertainment as it comes. Hey, listen, <clears throat> think about the number of ways you would use this. I I'll give you an example of me. All right. St. Patty's Day, all right? You, and there's so many different fun St. Patty's things you could put on here that would be on the, could be on your garage or on the screen or whatever you could do that, right? Uh, Easter, you could do Easter. Uh, you know, you could do your the Easter bunny, all that. You could put so many different images out there. Fourth of July, right? Uh, we get into the, the, the winter holiday months. Uh, you know, you've got Halloween and you get Thanksgiving and you get uh, Christmas, Hanukkah, uh, Kwanzaa, whatever holiday you celebrate, right? And then New Year's, you could have rockets going up. You, you can do that for $139. You don't have to spend $1,000 on a big screen TV. Uh, if you want a, a jumbo giant screen, this is the way you want to go. This is 130 inches. The biggest TV we sell here at HSN is what, uh, Andre, what, like 82? I think it's probably the biggest TV I think we sell here, over 80 inches. This is 50 inches bigger than that TV, the screen. And remember, years ago, we sold the portable projector. Then we sold the speaker, and then we sold the screen. We sold them all separately. That's just the way they were presented to us. We were able to bundle everything, so all you do is plug and play. It is that easy. A couple of our Facebook fans are wondering, uh, Julie, and I think I could figure it out for myself, sure. how far between the projector and the screen? Uh, we got it, I think, probably about 14, 15 feet is how, many, how far away uh, the projector is from the screen. So is that about a fair estimate? Yeah. Uh, you know what? I'm looking at my house. I'm inside, by the way, just yeah. um, casting it on a wall. And I would say, yes, I'm probably 15 feet. Um, and Guy, I was wondering in the studio, if when they're showing it in the studio, would they be able to pull back to show the actual projector? If you could show that. I don't know. If they can, yeah. it's fine. But yeah, it's we have a, we, So we'll get it's a camera shot going through the projector. Yeah, we could probably do that. We'll try. Yes. I'll see if Rebecca can, uh, can put, put that together for us. We'll try. But yeah, sure. it's, it's about okay. 15 feet. So, and I think maybe the reason people ask that question is because, if you guys can follow me over. Not yet. Oh, oh, I'll freeze. Well, I, want, I think what people want to know is can they gather in front of the screen? And you can. Absolutely. The, the projector is, yes. far, is far enough back that you could get probably 25 or 30 people right in front of the screen if they want to sit up closer to it. The screen does not have to be right in front uh, of the projector. So no worries there. So you can move it back, you know, anywhere from, I'd say, 13 to 18 feet. And that would, that'll be fine. We're lowering the lights on ours. So you can see there's plenty plenty of room in front of it like here I'll show you my, my hand is if I come I'll come right up to the uh, to, this is where the projector is okay and then I'll walk back and you'll see how far away I am from the projector so you see it's it's way up it's about 15 feet away all right and then and, and what's nice about it is if you had kids they could all be sitting on the grass because it, the projector is standing up about five, about four and a half five feet so if the kids wanted to get on little uh, lower level chairs or hang out on the grass or on a picnic blanket they could do that as well i cannot get over the picture quality i cannot get over just how immensely large this is i mean let's put it this way when i used to run bars and restaurants many many years ago uh we had a place called Tommy's great restaurant right center of town and I would throw a uh, uh, the big game party you know the one that's really super that game so we would throw this big party at balloons I went crazy and I would rent all right a seven foot screen rent it and it was a projector okay you know what I paid for the day to rent that projector, Julie? I paid $500 just to rent it <laughs> for one day with the screen. Oh, my goodness. Well, it, and, hey, it let me tell you. It probably wasn't high definition. No, but it, no, this is, it was probably 7, 8. This is back, I'm talking like back in the 90s or whatever it was. But, but the point is, it was still worth it to me because we quadruple business on that day. And people came because they wanted to see the big screen TV. They didn't have big, giant TVs back then. 
And there weren't 80 inch TVs back in the, you know, back in the, especially in the 80s and stuff like that. Not ones that you didn't spend $15,000 on that were this wide, you know, plasmas and things. The flat screens, you know, really are in the last 10 years. But now you can have a screen anywhere you want, front of the house, side of the house, down in the basement, up in the attic, wherever you want, out by the pool with the kids, you can do it. And for, tw what's, I, I'm, I'm a little blind from looking into the camera. What, what's the flex play, Andre? 28? $28 in free shipping and handling. Do not wait for this. Oh, Order oh it right goodness. now. You will love it. You'll use it all year long. It makes a great Mother's Day gift, a great Father's Day gift. Julie, we got about a minute left for you to wrap it all okay. up. Okay. I love Mother's Day. Any mother would love to have her family and the neighbor kids, or if you're a grandparent, how great would it be to have everybody gathering at your house watching either family videos, which if you have a, like a flash drive or if you have a, a, a stick, all you have to do is plug it into the side. It's plug and play. Now you do want to plug in the actual projector to the wall, but I love the question guy. And the other thing is the projector is adjustable. You can put it up a little higher we use it on our deck outside and everybody's in front of it we're just sitting in our regular patio furniture there's no heads bobbing here so you can adjust the projector if that was maybe what the question was about but high definition and edge to edge the screen itself is 130 inches so that's double what a 65 inch tv is this turns the projector into a smart tv and uh plug in your sticks or you can cast from your phone or you can also cast from a laptop. The other thing, HSN is the only place that is going to give you the Bluetooth wireless speaker, and it has these fun flashing LED yeah. lights that the kids are going to absolutely flip. It's everything. And by the way, you can use it's everything. Yeah. You can use the speaker with or without the system. If you don't want to use the speaker and you just want to use the speaker that's in the actual projector, yeah. you can do that yep. too. But HSN is the only place that gives you that bonus speaker, so it makes it just a great Jill, value. Let and me show everybody. So this is for Sue, one of my Facebook people. Sue, there's the projector. There's the screen, okay? So you can see it's just about 15 feet. So no worries there if you want to well, we'll get it. She's got a small backyard, so she's worried about that. Thank you, Julie. We love our Julie. Thank you you everybody again i apologize for no facebook bad weather here gotta get home uh we got tornadoes and stuff like that but i will be continuing next week with our facebook live but i'm also going to be doing uh tina and ty show it'll be tina and not ty but guy monday i start at eight so i'll see you guys then have a great day and enjoy the rest of your